Hey everybody, it's Giovanni Cruz, and this is my MT4 trading course. Okay, so a lot of people are learning how to trade right now and really becoming really good at trading and analyzing on the trading view. Okay, but um, a lot of traders can, you know, analyze on a trading view, mark up the charts on a trading view, but I'm here to teach you guys how to trade anywhere in the world. Okay, I want you guys to be able to trade while you are taking a shit. Okay, so let's jump into it. Right here, you see your currencies. On the left side is your currencies. Next to the currencies, you see it says spread. The spread is the fee that the brokers take out of each trade. Okay, on the right side, you see the red and blue lights flashing. It is the value of the currencies. If you pay attention, it says it says the low of the day and the high of the day. The lowest that price has gotten for that day and the highest the price has gotten for that day on each currency. Okay, so it probably will start out like this simple, but make sure you click it to advance. Okay, you guys don't have to pay too much attention to this. Just pay attention to the name of the currency and the spread. Okay, if you want to get rid of any currency pair, just click on this pen on the left corner and you can delete it like so. On the right corner, we have the plus sign where you can add Forex majors, exotics, indices, futures, stocks, Forex crosses, energies, metals, and cryptos. Okay, depending on your broker, you may have more than that, but... If you want to look for anything, you can use the search bar and say I'm looking for gold. There it is. XAU US dollar gold. And I just added gold. Now, let's go to the now. A lot of people's charts may look different. I want you guys charts to look just how it does on trading view. Okay, well, my candles is green and red, just how Usually every beginner trader is taught to see the markets as green and red candlesticks, bulls and bears. So let's make sure that your chart has green and red candlesticks. So you go to settings, okay, and go to charts. Make sure it's on candlesticks, volumes doesn't have to be on, ask price line on, trade levels on, go to colors, and this is my settings. So you guys can just go ahead and copy my settings. I don't mind. Copy my settings. Just make sure that your bull candle is green and your bear candle is red, at least while you're learning. After you start to get the hang of it, you can customize it however you want. Okay? Here in the settings, you can also create a new account and you can manage your accounts. This is where your trade history is going to be. Okay. So you're going to be able to see, you know, what you did for the day, the week, the month, and you can customize it. Okay. So this is where you're going to see your balance, in the trade tab, your equity, your margin. As you can see, I have 3000 in this demo account. Okay. Now, if you are ready to place a trade, you're going to press the plus sign in the right corner. Okay, you can enter a trade like that. Or you can enter a trade by going onto the chart of the currency that you want to trade and press trade. Okay, you can also go to quotes. Pick the pair. Select the pair you want to trade. Click on it and press trade. Or you can go to see the chart. Okay, now to zoom in and out, all you want to do is move your thumbs in and out on the screen, and then it will do that. Okay, and it's important knowing, it is important knowing how to use the MT4, especially if you want to copy and paste trade signals, okay? If you guys want to see an example of how to copy and paste, I will show you right now. Let's say that a signal was sent to you, like this signal right here. 
this signal says US DJPY is a cell. So you will go into your MT4 and look for US DJPY. This is US DJPY right here. You will click on it. Look at the chart if you want. If you're ready to trade, click on it. Trade. Put your stop loss number. You're going to put your stop loss number. Okay. Your stop loss in this case was 104.20, which is 15 pips. So you're going to put 104.20. And then your take profit, you could choose one of the take profits. I recommend taking the first one, which is 103.85. Okay, and it says sell, so you're going to press the sell button. So once you do that, it will place the trade, and then you just be patient and wait for your profits, okay? If it is going negative, don't stress. You have a stop loss to protect your account, okay? So this was just the first video showing you guys how to use MT4 on the mobile. And in the next video, I'm going to go over how to mark up your charts on your phone.